Peace and blessings, family. I go by the name of DJ912. Thanks for tuning in. You can always go to DJ912Beats.com to check me out. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and share. What we finna get into right now is um something I started on last night. Let's see where I can take it. Glad y'all tuning in. So I pretty much thinking this one is done, but um, I'm gonna see if I can add one more sound, and then I'm gonna get into the mix down of the track.
So what I'm looking for is something that I can kind of um, play that has more of a musical um, tone to it. And I'm just going through sounds right now. But I think I got another plug in that I can jump straight into and find it. So a couple more sounds in here, and then I'm going to switch out. Switch plug in. So right now I'm finna go into the mixing process. What I just did was started from the left channel, hold down control, 
left click all the way through to my last instrument. <coughs> Excuse me, to my last instrument. So I'm holding down control, highlighting all the way to my last instrument, left clicking, then I drag everything down. Um, and let's get to it. This right here is more bass oriented, more sub oriented, so don't have an 808 in it, I just got a regular kick in it. Um, and I got the kick layered to give it a thicker, fatter sound, but I think I'm gonna have to end up changing those out too. But here we go. Hey, so what I just did was go into the plugin, plugin window like this, go to your rent tool, turn your volume up. Um, some of these plugins be loud, some of them don't, so that's a way to get extra volume without killing the track or the channel. Um, and this is, this is the plugin I'm using for my um, for the piano in this, it's, it's a Sony Vox 88 key. So if you want to know how to mute, I mean, um, slide the channel uh, in your rack from left to right, you take that channel, you highlight it, and you hit Alt, left, or either right. So Alt, left, Alt, right, moves your channel from left to right.
So check it on this bass right now. I um I put this on here to give it a little distortion. It's a you know free plug plugin that comes with Fruity Loops that gives you a little distortion. I'll let y'all hear the difference in it. Take it off. Put it back on. Then I just rolled off the, I rolled off the top end and boosted the low end. So a simple change. That's pretty much the beat, man. I'm gonna track it out and we see what's going.
Now I'm sitting here the whole time trying to figure out why in the heck my kick sounding like that. I ain't getting the thickness, the body of it, or nothing. I had it on the wrong note. So it was an octave higher. It should have been on this octave. It was on this octave. Simple changes, simple changes. Take it off and um, replace it with this halftime plug in. Right. Mic check. So I'm gonna replace this gross beat plug in with this halftime plug in, see what it sound like real quick. pretty much the beat i hope y'all enjoy um check back in make sure you like subscribe and comment on this channel no negative all positive vibes